I'm Noah. And I am Brett. And we're here to introduce you to the future of insulation. Some napkins. <laughs> okay, so uh, what this is, is it's a, it's a stack of napkins with note cards taped to the top. And, uh, and that's it. We tape the sides together to try to keep in the heat. Mm -hmm. Alright. This one's for you, champ. Uh, he really can <laughs> These were some of the constraints we had to deal with. Uh, our, our insulation needed to be eco-friendly, made from recyclable materials. Uh, it could only be one inch thick, and it had to fit precisely on the box that we did this experiment for. Um, here's some of the statistics that we collected. You can see our maximum internal temperature is probably the most important one compared to the maximum room temperature. <coughs> didn't release the heat out of the, the room. So I could put a difference there, which is good. <laughs> a continuation of the math. We... Alright, so the total uh, energy gain uh, inside was 163 joules. Uh, the energy lost through the insulation was 84.2. And that means that 79 joules were retained, and that was 48%, which was pretty good compared to the other groups. Uh, and just a quick little something, the difference between max internal and max room was 34.6 degrees. So it kept in the temperature pretty long. But it was a pretty good insulation. Those little facts. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> we are in the